So hey y'all, hey, so I'm gonna wash my hair, do a scalp detox because my hair is, it's just a mess, dangerous, like a mess. <coughs> so I'm gonna do a scalp detox because my hair needs to, I haven't did a scalp detox in a very long time, but we need it. Show y'all my scalp. This is what my scalp look like. This is what it look like. Dangerous. The dandruff is falling up. As I'm pulling my hair apart, the dandruff is falling. This is what it's look like. I feel like it's not as bad as it been. This is what my scalp looks like. So we need to do a detox. This is what it look like. So I use this um, Aztec healing um, clay. I had this for a long time and I forgot I had it. So this is what we're gonna use to do our um, DIY scalp detox with some um, apple cider vinegar as well. And I'm gonna use some grapeseed oil. Okay, yeah, this is how I look. I'm just gonna um, comb my hair out and just apply it to my scalp first because my scalp needs the most attention. So this is how I look, and I added some water to it as well. It looked like cement. <laughs> but yes, I'm gonna just comb my hair out and then add it to my scalp. <laughs> This is how my hair looks. I just combed it all out. See that dandruff? This is how my hair looks. This is the hair that came out of my head while combing. Okay, so I'm just gonna start um, putting the, so I'm just gonna start putting it on my hair. Like I said, I'm putting it on my scalp first because my scalp needs the most attention. This is how my hair is looking. Um, yeah, I just took some and just put it all over my hair. But I did do my scalp first because my scalp needs the most attention. So we're just gonna worry about the scalp. I am gonna put a little bit more on my hair, but this is how it's looking for now. And I'm getting this stuff everywhere in my bathroom. It's messy, so don't be messy like me, y'all. Don't be like me. I just be doing all type of stuff. Don't be like me. But anyways, um. um yeah, I'm gonna let this stuff sit on my hair for about 30 minutes. Like a plastic cap or anything, so I'm just gonna let it just sit. But yes, this is how we looking. So we're gonna let it sit for 30 minutes on our scalp and our hair. Okay, y'all, this is how my hair is looking now. It's really like hard and stiff. So. That's what it look like. Hard and stiff. Feel real crazy. So I'm gonna wash it out. Um, a lot of people don't use like shampoo and conditioner after they put the, put this on their hair. So we'll see. But um, sometimes it can be a little bit hard to get this stuff out of your hair. So it's gonna take me some time to wash this stuff out of my hair because I have a lot of hair. So. Let me um get to washing this out of my hair. Okay, I am finished washing my hair. This is what it's looking like. Straight out of the shower. This is 
what it's looking like. Okay, okay, let me show you my scalp. This is my scalp. I probably still have a little bit of the clay mask in my hair. I washed my or rinsed my hair out like three times because it was still clumped up in my hair. But this is what my scalp is looking like. It's clean. So this is all. This is the hair that came off of my hair when I was in the shower. So I did not put nothing else in my hair, no shampoo, no conditioner. I just put the uh, clay mask in there and washed it out. But make sure you wash the clay mask out of your hair. I probably still got a little bit in here. But yeah, I'm just about to blow dry my hair. So yeah, I'm gonna put some grease in my hair. And I'm gonna shut out the grease that I'm gonna put in my hair in one second. So I'm just gonna Desangle my hair and blow dry it. Okay, y'all just finished um, blow drying my hair. This is how it looks. It's blow dried. My hair is growing so good from when I cut it. I just need my ends clipped. I think I'm just going to get them done professionally because sometimes I don't know what I'll be doing. I'll be cutting up my hair, just cutting it up. But anyways, y'all, I'm going to grease my hair and probably just put it in two French braids. I'm not going to do too much to it because I don't want to put um, that much product in my hair. But anyways, y'all, go and watch some of my other um, wash day routines so you guys can see how my hair has been coming along. But anyways, y'all, I'm going to grease my hair. Let me show y'all this grease. Hey, y'all, this is the grease that I'm going to be using on my hair. This is my first time um, using this grease on my hair. And I heard it was really good for dry scalp and dandruff and stuff like that. So, we are going to be greasing our hair with this today. And this is the only thing I'm going to put in my hair. I'm not going to smell medicate it because I guess it's supposed to medicate your hair, your scalp, or whatever. But this is how it looks. So yeah, I'm going to just grease my entire head with this grease and make me two French braids. Okay y'all, so I just went through and greased my entire scalp with the grease. My scalp feel really, really good. So this is how my scalp looks. So this is how my scalp is looking. It's looking feels good I have to get my uh, ends clipped because they are brittly from when I um, dyed my hair but I'm just gonna uh, put two French sprays in it and then that's gonna be it but my scalp feels so good y'all like so good like it feel really good okay y'all that's it for this video I just read it, did my hair in two braids and I wore these braids for about a week and then um, probably do something else in my hair. I don't know. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys like, subscribe, share this channel, leave me a comment, let me know what you think. I love you guys so much, but I'll see you when I see you. Peace.